Hello, Tom McPherson here with a simple way to draw a house using two-point perspective surrounded by mountains. For this drawing, we're looking up at the house so that we need to draw the house above the horizon line. If you'd like to learn more about drawing, please visit circlelineartschool.com where you will find full details of my online drawing courses for beginners. For this drawing, first draw a horizon line below the middle of your page. For the horizon line is our eye level, everything above the horizon line we're looking up at, and everything below the horizon line we're looking down at. And then draw two vanishing points as far apart as they can be. Next, draw the nearest vertical edge of the house, high above your horizon line. This is just a short vertical line. Now we can draw two receding lines to the right vanishing point, and then two more receding lines to the left vanishing point for the right and left sides of the house. Next, draw a vertical line on the left and the right of the first vertical line to show where the edges of the house stop on the left and the right. Next, we could draw a guideline for the base of the house to the left vanishing point and then another guideline to the right vanishing point. These lines are just for information. We're not really going to use these in the finished drawing because the house we're drawing will be on a hill rather than floating above the horizon as it is now. Next, draw a cross on the right to find the centre point and then draw a soft vertical guideline going upwards to find the top point of a pitched roof. And then we can just draw two lines to make it into a triangle for the side of the roof. Next, we can use the left vanishing point to extend the roof going right by extending the lines to the right. And then we can also find the ridge of the roof by drawing a line from the top point of the triangle of the roof towards the left vanishing point. For the back edge of the roof, we can just copy the angle of the line at the front edge of the roof. Next, we could extend the front of the roof so that it has a overhang. To do this, just extend the lines that we have already drawn and copy the angle of the lines that we've already drawn too. At this stage in the drawing, we could add a thickness to the edge of the roof just by doubling up the lines along the edge. And we could start to add some details to the drawing too. We can draw some receding lines to the right and the left vanishing points to make this house into a simple log cabin. We could add some lines on the roof, just copying the lines that the roof already has. We could add a door and some windows. The receding angles, the top and bottom lines of the doors and windows, will go towards one of the two vanishing points in this simple drawing which uses two-point perspective. Next, we could draw a hill so the house is not floating anymore. And then we could draw a path coming towards us, getting wider as it comes towards us, the viewer of the image. And then we could add some mountains in the background to finish off the drawing. You could shade in one side of the mountains or add trees and details, anything you like. This is just the basic start of a drawing. If you'd like to learn more about drawing, please visit circlelineartschool.com where you will find full details of my online drawing courses for beginners. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it useful for your own drawings. I post a new video every week. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel to keep up to date with the content that I make. Thanks for watching and see you next time.